Hi you guys. Um, it is Sunday for me. Hold on. I'm like peeking outside because today is the day that we're finally going to decorate the patio. Um, patio decorating video finally so yesterday i wanted to do this but i was on my ass all day yesterday i got my second vaccine shot and i was just so tired the next day that i was just like no it's not happening my stomach was hurting my muscles was sore like whole body not just my arm where i got the shot the whole body was just done for and i just went to sleep after I worked my little four hours of work, I went to sleep and I was just done for for the rest of the day. I woke up, watched um, some little stuff on Netflix, ate some pizza and then went back to sleep. So I didn't do anything. I'm starving today. I feel a lot better. I still have this weird taste in my mouth, but I just may be dehydrated because you know, that's my constant state. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get this patio decorated. I have the couch here back there that's some curtains and a curtain rod down there is a grill we got our rug here we got a table so yeah i'm going to go to try to just go to the store and get a couple more other things i want like a plant probably like a side table or like a foot rest so i'm gonna go to at home and then i'm going to try like tj maxx marshall's those kind of stores to see if i can find any outdoor sorry any like outdoor seating or something for out there so yeah let's get it going i'm starving i know today i'm supposed to do my sunday lunch stream but i've missed now this would be the second sunday i believe but it is 11:33 right now and usually i don't hop on to like one two ish but i seriously can't wait i am starving i'm kind of tempted to see if i could just do one in my car but it's still kind of early like i don't even know Ugh. my ac unit was supposed to come yesterday it didn't but it's supposed to come today so hopefully that shows up i still have this big bag of or the big basket full of clothes I need to donate but I think I'll drop that off tomorrow while I'm out like I'm not I'll do it tomorrow because it's Memorial Day tomorrow and I'm off that day um I got my phone I need to grab my water shit, shit damn okay um that was weird uh, <laughs> I got my water my phone my purse is right there <sighs> I need to go grocery shopping basically everything that I have to do today or everything I usually do on Saturday I have to do today because I didn't do anything yesterday so yeah phone I didn't charge my second battery so I hope it's not too dead I'm gonna leave it there for a second. I might just leave that battery here charging so that when I, cause I have no idea what this battery's on. Ooh, I shouldn't have messed with it. Anyway. Let's go eat. I'm trying to get some five guys. I'm hungry. I'm going to see what I can do. Whatever, see you guys in the car. All right, now it is getting warmer outside, but it's still only like 60 degrees, so it's still pretty chilly. And let me grab my little table. We got our five guys. I saw five guys was trending on Twitter, and I didn't understand why, and then people were just complaining about how expensive it is. I got a little cheeseburger and a little fry and I'm like $9 and some change. I feel like that's pretty good for always fresh fries. Everything is made to order. Like, I don't know. Oh, I literally forgot to ask for extra cheese. Whoops. I mean, they make everything right in front of you.
there. I had to like lower my seat a little bit so you guys can see me and the food a little bit. I mean, there's just too many fries in this bag right now. The main event is the cheeseburger that is covered in grease for whatever reason. Okay, that's weird. Whatever. <laughs> I hope that's focusing. Mm -hmm. And I resisted and did not get a pop today. I got a water. The steering wheel is kind of blocking the food, huh? I'm sitting across from Whole Foods because when I get done, I'm going to go inside and get some guac. I'm gonna get back to eating and I'll be back because we're gonna go into Whole Foods and then we're gonna go kind of on the other side of the lot and go to Home Goods, see if we can find some outdoor decor. We also need to grocery shop today. So we're kind of busy today. I will see you guys in the next clip. So I just got to, hold on, let me turn my car off. So let me show you, let me, let me, yeah, let me show you guys because I'm so flustered. So I just got to TJ Maxx Marshalls and all that. And I look over to my left and let me show you what I saw. Scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Why would you have that in your car like that? In the back seat, no less, as if she's a passenger. Like, first of all, ma'am, I thought you died. <laughs> what are you doing in this vehicle? <laughs> oh, it's so creepy and lifelike. <laughs> but okay, I'm still looking for an ottoman and a house plant or an outdoor, like, fake plant to go on the patio so I can get that and then go grocery shopping. Like, it's already 12.49. I need to hurry up and get to getting so I can get home. I also want some like soft serve ice cream like on a cone. Like the blue kind that you get from Kings Island. So it's like blueberry. That's what I need. I need to find some place that's serving that. But it's Sunday so I'm like who's open. <sighs> okay. Still trying to catch my breath from Miss Ginsburg scaring me. <laughs> so let me go ahead and go inside and I'll be back. Hopefully I can find something because this will be the second location I've gone to looking for a plant in an ottoman, but yeah. All right, we just got back in the house and we're about to head back out again. It's 2.45 and I just found out the ice cream place is still open. So we're gonna head back out. But I wanted to show you the groceries I got because tomorrow I'm going to grill out for Memorial Day. Lemonade. Potatoes for the potato salad. Corn. Bread for the hot dogs. I really wanted some of these orange and cream bars last night. So that's what I got because these are so good. French fries just for whatever this little mini grill plate so I don't have to put my food and stuff directly on the grill I can place it on this fun running out of counter space mac and cheese noodles for the mac and cheese baked beans for the baked beans lighter fluid for setting things on fire foil for wrapping things in foil uh, we got water and I think that's all. That's everything I got. 
and I'm about to run out get this ice cream and then I'm gonna come back and we're gonna start on the patio because we had a lot to do and I want to hurry up and get this done so I'll be right back gonna go get this ice cream and come back back home with the ice cream and this is blueberry ice cream and it's actual ice cream not sherbet or whatever It's so good. And usually when I go to Kings Island to get this, they give you this huge ass comb and you're like, I have to finish it. And about the time you get halfway through, your tongue is so numb, you don't even taste the ice cream anymore. I can put this in the freezer, eat it later. So now the funnel cakes and the blue ice blue ice cream were the only two things that were making me go to King's Island. Now I can get both right where I live, like not even 10 minutes. So never going to King's Island ever again. Okay, that's going in the freezer. Let's go ahead and start on the patio. I'm going to put you guys up on the tripod and we're gonna go outside. So I finally got everything outside. Let me show you everything that we have and then we're gonna get started. All right, so we have the couch that's like over there. It's huge, I'm not gonna bother picking that up. We got a rug, a mirror, a little stand for our little fake plant got these humongous windmills. <laughs> it's bigger than my head. <laughs> I got these really cool floral lights. table we got a plant right here ottoman throw pillows citronella candles to make the mosquitoes go away this cute little rose plate to put the candle on this is a curtain and a curtain rod let's get to business so I can go ahead and get all the hard stuff out the way I'm getting hot already. Let me put my hair up in a ponytail, take this jacket off, and we can get to work. <laughs> that looks super crazy. <laughs> like with it, no railing right there at all, it makes me feel like I'm gonna fall. Yeah, be careful. Yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised I was able to remove that from my hands. Are you just gonna pull it off? Ooh. With no gloves, you're gonna get a splinter. I got calluses on my gloves. <laughs> I've been building them for years. Well, that's actually in there pretty good. This one came right off. That's a good thing. Because mm -hmm. at least I'd have more stairs to cushion my fall versus the ground. <laughs> Some nice ground. You just have to make it past concrete. <laughs> So, getting a little bit of the work. <laughs>
It smells like like s'mores or something, like marshmallows. It does a little bit. <laughs> I used to feel like Black and Decker was like the best tools, but now I feel like this DeWalt, this, this yellow stuff is better. But then they had like the green ones. Are the green ones more like the discount ones or is Black and Decker the discount? You know, uh, the green ones usually are either Ryobi or Hitachi. Yeah, I think it's the Ryobi. That's like a uh, Home Depot's brand. Uh huh. Like, you know, they're exclusive to Home Depot. I just like, because I like everything to be the same color. Oh yeah. So I got stuck with Black & Decker, but... I've grown on DeWalt, so... <clears throat> yeah. It's cooler because they're like bumblebee colors. I should have asked them for like some type of a, what do you call it? Because I use only DeWalt. Yeah. Maybe they'll give me like a... Like a brand deal? <laughs> You're like, and you guys need to sponsor me. They should. Honestly, doing good work. And you buy all their products. It's weird. Like one minute they want to use screws. Next minute, they want to use this. It was just a free for all. Feels extra crazy to be walking around out here with no railings. This oh, yeah. feels very, <laughs> it just feels like I'm gonna just walk right off. If you ever get a chance, walk on some steel beams. <laughs> no, I don't think I'll ever get the chance. <laughs> Catch this one being tossed. Oh yeah. Nice. <laughs> they're not wanting to break them. Nah, they're sturdy when they want to be. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, and it feels extra crazy because it's slanted like that. Oh yeah. Like looking at it is bad, but then looking at it without the railing is like, oh gosh. <laughs> open was it open floor plan balcony? <laughs> this is the new go. Yeah. <laughs> it's real. And every time you walk out. We love it. So it'll get crazier as I take these off, too. <laughs> it's gonna be a super open floor plan. <laughs> yep. Yeah. I'm glad he didn't ask me about the price tag. <laughs> Don't ask no questions, sir. <laughs> Wait till the door. Yeah. <laughs> the lighting is so bad because the sun is so bright. Oh, yeah. That's the hardest part, ain't it? Getting the right lighting and... Yeah. Cause you kind of want the... Oh! <laughs> you kind of want the light behind you and not in front of you. Yeah, and the sun is directly above us. Yeah. Cause then it has to go back on. So ugly. What the what? Yeah. All right, I'll get out the way. <laughs> you scared of heights? No. I mean, I don't know. I might be. I don't, well, I've never really been at heights. <laughs> See, I don't know if these screws are just nails or what. I'm, I'm just... like, at least you're wearing glasses. That's a little bit of a goggle. Yeah. I probably would it if I didn't have description. You're living life too far on the edge, sir. <laughs> Well, you probably got some good leverage now that it's just open right there. Oh, <laughs> oh they ran out of it. It doesn't even like, it's a new door, but it doesn't seem like this is new. Like, look how hor like who ate this? Nice. That is horrible. Is that, why does it look like that? Like I so eaten. Know. I've never looked at it like that. Maybe someone lives here with the dog. <laughs> and it's just chewed it. <laughs> I mean, that is dog level. But at the same time, what kind of horse of a dog do you have that's like chewing way up here? Like it goes all the way up. I think it's dog trying to get in the door. Oh, poor thing. I think so. Hopefully 
none of my neighbors are down there just casually walking. <laughs> That'd be kind of bad. <laughs> trying to talk as fast as I can. Once I get some of these off, I'll have a visual mm -hmm. where I'm throwing it. Oh, what's that around the corner there? What's that? Right here? Yeah, is that just gross? Oh. <laughs> That's, That's why it's so wobbly because that part's not stable. Yeah, there's nothing actually holding that corner together. They basically screwed this up. Oh, wow. There is a lot. And it looks like they're carrying larvas. It's probably not even going to zoom in. Or... Ah! Oh, my God. <laughs> you okay? No, are you okay? I'm okay. I was fine. I saw you coming through. See, like... <laughs> And you put weight down, like where I cut it? Yeah. Like, I always keep footing, so even if I get like this. <laughs> I was back here on this sturdy part. I thought you were coming through the floor. <laughs> no, I would never fall. I've never fallen. Well, I, actually, I take that back. I didn't fall at that little city I was telling you. But that's different. I didn't build that. Oh, disgusting. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I ate the little ollie. All right. Excuse the lighting. It's so weird because the sun is so bright, so it's just making everything look super dark. But as you can see, what we're working with now, get a nice view of my neighbors. <laughs> Gonna go walk over here and peek over. He's like killing it. He's got all the trash picked up. <laughs> so you see how easy he's knocking those off? Yeah. That's what I was you. But now look, if you look right, right here, they're encased. So you would have to knock out one, two, like 12 screws to right. knock one of these out. The next asshole that's going to have to take this apart going to be really upset. They should have to. I did too good of a job. Years. Oh, well, in 15 years, the next asshole is going to be really upset. <laughs> <laughs> Not our problem. <laughs> I mean, I, I was upset when I almost fell and Daniel almost fell. Yeah! <laughs> Two people almost lost their lives on my deck. <laughs> yeah, she's gonna be, well, she's not here anyway. She, no, she probably won't even care we're about. We're clean all this up too. Okay. He's gonna focus on cleaning. I gotta go to a leak and then uh, I'm gonna go check the leak first, see if I need parts, and now I'm gonna go. And when I go, I'm gonna get the three pieces. This is great. <laughs> all right i look a hot mess but it is oh, there's like gnats in, there's like mosquitoes or something in here because the door was open but it is 9 33 oh go ahead and show you guys the update on the patio Very nice. They're supposed to come painted and I guess finish up tomorrow. I'm about to take me a nice bath and call it a night, but I can't wait to decorate that outside space.
little broom. Okay. Oh, you put a meat on there? Hopefully it stays up. <laughs> I put the little um the little sticky things, the command strips. Oh maybe you need a screw maybe? Put like a nail or something around well, it. Maybe you want to screw it here. Yeah. Probably if I put some nails like around and then underneath and then kind of bend them so that they're like. Mm, yeah. Sure. Okay. Yeah, maybe you could put it like center right here, like pressure. Like. Yeah, right here. Mm -hmm. And then at the bottom. Yeah. Right, I'm going to get my nails and stuff. Hopefully that stays. I'm more concerned about the rain and stuff. Uh, yeah, it's good. Oh, nice. Coming along. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so maintenance people are gone now for now. They'll be back tomorrow to do stuff and I'll show you guys what they're working on. But let me show you the outdoor patio. I had to do everything quietly, like in a time lapse because they were working, people coming in and out and I was just like, okay, whatever. Uh, but I'll show you what's, now that it's all set up and pretty. Look how pretty that is this rug is blue but you can barely tell i guess you can kind of tell with the black ottoman there that it's not black it's blue but nice little curtain we got these solar lights nice little couch this plate is for me to place my drinks and stuff on it i got from target it was like five dollars in their little dollar section but i figured i could put my plates or my cups on this instead of the actual table this is the little um plate thing i'm gonna put the little centronella candles on just to keep the bugs away we hung this mirror up and the maintenance man was kind enough to help me with this because when i put it up with the stickies and then walked away it actually fell because the stickies were not enough to reinforce it so we did have to go ahead and put some nails up on there so that looks a lot better we have this cute plant so it's like a planter and then I got this separate plant to put in there and there's actual some bubble wrap or some of that bubble foam stuff is at the bottom so that this part is raised up so you can actually see how cool that vase is. Planter, I don't know. And we have these cute windmills that probably won't turn because of how I got everything sitting there but they're more for decorative reasons anyway, just for a little bit of color. We have these solar power lights that are not lit up right now because it's trying to I don't know absorb some energy or charge so whenever those get done or uh, light up I'll be able to show you guys that but then we got the cute little ottoman I love it and I can't wait to sit out there later on today well as soon as I get done doing all this I'm about to go sit down out there and just relax and eat that ice cream um they're redoing this wall because it was like super cracky and ugly. So this wall's getting redone. The baseboards in the hallway were also very ugly. So they're redoing those. Um, this side didn't have any. And I'm finally, you guys, getting a bedroom door. Here's the door right there. It's finally coming and 
Ever since Ricky Raccoon came in, they had to gut my closet and it never got refinished. So I'm finally getting my closet done. Yay. The AC was supposed to come today, it did not, but the maintenance people had to go because they had an emergency at another unit, so they had to leave. And they said they'll put the AC unit in for me, so I guess whenever, tomorrow when they come back, they can put my AC unit in. This chair, I'm kinda on the fence about this chair. I think I might keep it and put it right here in this corner because I don't have anywhere else to put it. I'm kinda tempted to return it, I don't know. I feel like, it was kind of, it was an $89 chair. Like it's a cool chair, but I feel like if I want a chair in my bedroom, cause I bought it to go outside. I feel like I can get a cooler chair to go in my bedroom if I wanted something to fill in this space. I don't know if this chair, I mean, it fits my vibe, but I just don't know. I just don't know if this chair is it. It's a cool chair, but I'd rather have a chair that's like extra comfortable, like with some arms, like a nice armchair. I mean, it's just so circle. Yeah, I think this chair is going back. I want my money back. So I'm taking the chair back. I don't really want it. Um, 6.32, I wonder what time they close today. I wonder should I just take it back today or should I just wait to another day? Anywho, let's go ahead and open up this grill. We got the grill for tomorrow because we're grilling tomorrow. Let's go ahead and go outside and put this together. So we can see what's going on with that. And then we're gonna be done with all the, my camera, come on, come on camera. Um, hold on, let me put you guys down and I'll bring the grill outside. Look how nice it is just to sit out here. All right, we got the grill set up finally. I'm going to switch out this battery because this one's gonna die, grab my computer and stuff so we can at least hang out out here and edit a video maybe. Uh, be right back. Eight forty-five ish I just got done editing like a quick video. I am tired. I just sit out here. There was a little black cat and I tried to get like a little video of him, but he was just a little too quick. So I couldn't capture him on film. Sorry, you guys, I tried. Um, yeah, I'm done editing. It's getting kind of cold out here. I put on this sweatshirt to save me, but it's cold. I want to go back inside. The grill is so mini and adorable. I wish I had something else to eat, but I don't. I'm just gonna eat queso 
and eat ice cream because I ate my burger, ate all my fries, I don't have anything else, so. <sighs> I'll probably end up editing this video while I'm relaxing because I'm watching the show on Netflix. It's called, it's so good. Like I was just watching so many episodes of it last night. It's called the Harlan Coben, Harlan Coben's The Five. It's probably based off a book, who knows? Cause why, well, I don't know. This is what it looks like. And it's like, <sighs> a lot of stuff is happening, but it's, it's good. Come on, oh, there it is. Also, I don't know why my hair looks so black. Like sometimes my hair looks really brown or like reddish in the sun, but right now we've got black hair. I might not even have to dye it black because it looks pretty black now. Anywho, let's go in the house. These solar lights still have not attracted enough solar to charge. So we have no light at the moment. Let me mess with them really quick, see if they do. This part is my favorite. Like, can you imagine just sitting here taking a picture? No, they're not charged enough. It's cold. It's not really a sunny day. I feel it. I'm not even mad at them. Let me gather up all my stuff. <laughs> Just... I love this little plant thing back here. It's so cute. And it was just so random when I was walking around at home trying to find some sort of plant that would be tall enough that I could sit here and you'd be able to see it and I couldn't find anything couldn't find anything and then I end up seeing this planter well okay I end up seeing the planter sitting in the display so I was like oh I'm gonna just take something off the display really quick and then I kept walking around and I found that plant because they had a different plant in their display and I was just like I don't know about that one I don't like the base and then I was walking around and then I saw some lady buying some of these for her kids and they were blowing on them. And at first I was like, what the hell are you guys doing? And then I was like, oh, I know what you guys are doing. And then I stopped judging and I bought three. But okay, um, grabbing my cup. Grabbing my little centronella candle since I didn't light them. They're gonna stink, I hate the way these smell. They're like a citrusy lemon Citronella. Oh, is that why they're called citronella? Because they're citrus? Bye, my gorgeous patio setup. I miss you already. Oh, wait, my hands are full. I'm going to get in the house. Um, put my laptop down really quick. I wish they hurry up and deliver my AC. I wish that already. Like that'd be great. So my nose, it just I just got a piece of fuzz or something in my nose and my hands are full. Ugh. I also did not end up getting that guac and I'm full of regret. Like I kind of feel like maybe I should go get that guac, but it's kind of late now. It's like almost nine o'clock. It's a little late to be harassing Whole Foods employees for guac. I feel like I'd be so annoying. <sighs> um damn i wish i had some chicken right now like some fried chicken i don't even want these sides like i would just eat the chicken no 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 it's fine i'm not gonna get anything i'm seriously going to eat the queso and some chips eat the ice cream and then relax i'm not even gonna I'm not even, uh, I left the door open and now there's like a fly on the ceiling. It's all my fault. I need to seriously clean in here again, as usual. And I threw away all those big bags. Oh, there's so much stuff in here. Oh. I have so much stuff in my kitchen because I had to clear the hallway so they can have a space to work. And now everything's in the kitchen. The microwave's blocked. I have to do a cooking with Chrissy tomorrow because I'm doing my, I'm grilling. I have to make my sides and the maintenance people are going to be here. Like I hate that because I can't really film and be myself when they're here. So it's kind of throwing me off schedule. Hopefully, I don't know. Maybe if I wake up early, start cooking, I can get that portion of the video filmed. 
maybe I can get up early because they usually show up in the evening-ish. Like, I don't know what time they're coming tomorrow. Maybe for the third time. I'll get up early, try to start on stuff. That way I'm not feeling super weird trying to vlog and cook and everything. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog decorating patio went grocery shopping vlog that today was and tomorrow's vlog is going to be a grilling slash cooking with Chrissy out on my new patio or balcony yeah Now I'm standing here thinking like, dang, should I have bought like chicken? Like what else should I put on the grill? But no, it's fine. It's fine. I always do this to myself. Okay. See you. See you tomorrow. Bye.